question I'd like to ask today is how can our industry utilize digital technologies to build substantial citizen connections, nurture communities and ensure equity for all? I really like this question because it touches things that I really care about. But I think a sensible place to start is, so what is it? a substantial citizen connection? Well, I think it's about connecting with the heart as well as connecting with the mind. I think it's about creating an emotional connection as well as a transactional connection. I think it's about a connection that allows us to think about our, the roles that we play. Are we thinking about the service? Are we thinking about the cost? Are we thinking about something greater than that? I think it's about working together to create real impact and drive change. I think it's about providing a mechanism whereby we can we, we can show commitment and passion to do the right thing. And, and it's very important that we provide, that we think about this in terms of providing equity so that everybody can join in. But I think when we do that, it's really important to think about who, who are we when we want to use these connections or what hats are we wearing when we're connecting with our utilities. So I've already mentioned, I think many of us think primarily as consumers, we care about what happens when we flick a switch, we expect reliable energy. We care about what happens when a turn, we turn a tap, we want clean water. We care about when we flush a toilet, does the water go away safely into the environment? Does it get treated properly? We care about those things. But actually, I think when we, when we think about substantial citizen connections, we're, we're thinking very much more about our role as a citizen. So we, we're extending that from service and cost and we're thinking about the environment. We're thinking about where does our energy come from? Where does the wastewater go? Is it, are, are our utilities operating ethically? And then sometimes as citizens, we get together in communities and we want a platform in order to express our opinion, express our views uh, and, and, and drive change. So when I think about this a little bit more, I, I, I think the digital technologies have been really good over the years at providing transactional connections. They're very good at allowing us to express our needs around consumer services. If we've got a problem, we can report a problem, we can check the status of a problem. They're very good, of course, at providing customer bills, payment services, all, all of those type of things. But actually, I'm quite interested in what role digital technologies have in order to provide the, the type of needs that we have as citizens, the emotional connections. Do they enable us to operate as communities? Do they enable us to come together as a movement to drive real change and, and drive action? I, I, I would argue that actually some of these technologies could enable that. And we've seen a number of examples around the world with, with, a, with the SEW platform as well as with, a, with, with, with other technologies where, where actually the, the solution is something that we're all very familiar with, which is platform technologies. We're, we're, we're all very used to expressing our, our, our social, social views on things like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, etc. But actually, how do we apply that type of technology to the utility sector? How do we apply that technology so that we can engage as citizens, that we can educate ourselves in terms of how our utilities are operating, how, that we can provide feedback to the utilities about how, the things that we expect from them? And, and how do we empower ourselves to be part of, of, of these communities so that we can act and do the right things? Now we've seen, as I mentioned, we've seen some great examples of this and we've seen those operating around the world. So I, I would argue that the digital technologies that we have today that provide transactional platforms or transactional connections, that they're also there to be extended to, to, to address the needs of the citizen and communities. We just need to extend them into broader reaches of our life, you know, so that we, we start thinking about our homes and our cities and our vehicles and our choices around transportation, our choices around um, other ways in which we run our lives. So I would say digital platform technologies is one of the ways in which we can address the needs of creating substantial citizen connections. Thank you.